So this man came, so he decided to debate King Kong versus Godzilla. I watched this video not too long ago, basically today as I'm recording this video. So he basically saying how Godzilla is lame and whatnot. You know what, everybody's entitled to their opinion, which even though it's whack, very whack, but I was really surprised this is the same man that says Spider-Man is lame. So can we really take him serious? But we all know why he says, why he hates Spider-Man so much. It's because he's built like Kingpin. We already know that. But, um, I feel like he was being biased a little bit in this video. I will sense a little bit of biasness. I'm going to explain to y'all in a second. So we're going to get into this, react this video, y'all. Saturday and I don't know how long. I don't miss Saturdays. This he gonna start talking about Godzilla in a minute. So I skipped ahead. This is what okay. He basically starts talking about Godzilla. I just got paid sixty thousand dollars for my car crash from using this I don't care. And I don't know if you I really see. don't. Okay. Um. So. I saw this last night, and this is when I was talking crazy about how Godzilla was extremely uncool and just lame. No, he's not. Queso is just jealous because Godzilla managed to lose weight before he did. Let's be real. Um. Ooh, man. And then I go to the comments, and there's some guy in here. Which, like, is, is, it's like, this guy right here. This, this guy right here. Like, Aaron Lopez 9045. Alright, let's just watch. This the dude's sitting here talking about, what is this comparison? W why is this comparison showing an older costume for Godzilla? Why not the new Godzilla? Yo, yo, Aaron. I don't care if it's old Godzilla or new Godzilla or not. Godzilla is lame no matter how you want to spin it, buddy. You know, we're going to find out why in a minute. No matter how you want to spin it, I don't care if it's brand new, CGI, I don't care what it is, yo, yo Aaron, it's lame. I can't think of something more lame than a giant lizard that's as big as a skyscraper that breathes fire and like shoots lasers out of his eyes. That's hey, the most elementary. Godzilla do not shoot lasers out of his eyes. He did not like that's like bro. Do you think I'm a Hannibal Bear Godzilla? As far as fire out of his mouth is not just ordinary fire. It's literally atomic fire. There's a difference. Atomic fire actually causes mad destruction. Regular fire don't. And my thing is, if you if you if you like, if you're a big fan of giant dinosaurs fighting, you should be a fan of Godzilla. Cause that's all. That's that's, that's like all it is. Is God is it's like dinosaurs fighting said twenty times more cool. But hang on, I'm gonna show you what he's made up stuff I've minute. ever seen in my life. You wanna know what's cooler than that? A giant gorilla that can climb skyscrapers and grab helicopters out. How? Literally how? King, he's, 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 <coughs> he's not talking about the Monster vs. King Kong. I can see if you talk about the Monster vs. King Kong because that would be debatable. He's talking about a regular King Kong. How is a... Let's, let, me, let me put it this way. A 13 foot, I don't know how tall he was, a 13 foot gorilla climbing a skyscraper. Cool. I mean, a gorilla size of a T Rex, I'm gonna just say that. How is that more cooler than a giant radioactive lizard that can shoot atomic fire and cause mad destruction? The same lizard that can drill a, 
a tire it can use its tiny breath to drill a hole into the earth within five minutes, maybe less. I don't know. How the sky? How is the like how? Crazy part is that's not the only comment he left. Let's scroll down, shall we? Look, 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 look how, look how, look how, look how mad he is. And look how mad you are for, for my leaving a comment. It clearly bothered you. Yo, yo, Aaron, I'm sorry. Godzilla's not cool, Aaron. The same guy that says Spider-Man is lame. There ain't no way you're a His opinion is literally garbage. you think a giant lizard that shoots lasers is cool, dude. He don't shoot lasers. Yeah, this is... Case is literally being ignorant right now. He literally... That means he basically knows nothing about Godzilla. The fact that he said he shoots lasers is absolutely diabolical. The irony? What do you mean the irony? Could he be like Godzilla? Is that the why? You're a grown man about to break his chair in half. Yo, can we get Ooh. that to the man, please? I could lie. I was kind of Oh, low. his name is Queso Tsunami. Yeah, give him a name. <laughs> you got cooked? Oh, oh, I got cooked. Yes. Oh, oh, Chad, I got cooked? Did I yes. really? Yes, you did. What's this poll? Who was cooler? Godzilla or King Kong? Chad, now, here's the thing. This man pulled it twice. Well, somebody else pulled this one, but it was a poll twice, and Godzilla won two times. But when Kaiser pulled pulled it at the end, that's when King Kong barely won. A chat switched up at the end, trying to please Kaiser or whatever. Can't, man, hold on. on this. Everybody vote on this. What are y'all doing? Like. Are you kidding? Like, it was literally two polls before the one in the end, and Godzilla won two. No, this isn't right. And he's Last mad about he it. Hold this. He's Godzilla mad about King it. Godzilla King Kong literally won. Look at it coming back now. Look at it, it's coming back. Yeah, I, I don't wait. To be, honest, one. to be honest, I don't know because his face came in the way, so I don't know who's winning. Godzilla would win. Or, I mean, King Kong would win. Should we run another one? Let's run another one. That, that's a biased poll and it doesn't count. No, it's not. You're being, bro, if, if the poll was being biased, then that means you're just simply being biased yourself by saying King Kong is, by no. You you can, you can say King Kong is cool to Godzilla, but to say Godzilla is vain, to say Ratchet from Ratchet Clank is cooler than Godzilla, are you serious? Ratchet from Ratchet Clank, I believe he said that. Hold up. That now that is pure bias. Welcome. As a matter of fact, he even seen my first call is cool to Godzilla. He's talking about two. the um, all the earlier call incarnations that's cool to Godzilla. What is cool about so you t so with that logic, what is cool about a giant gorilla swiping at a helicopter? The same gorilla that dies to bullets. Meanwhile, this man guy's looking to take a whole nuke. It won't even kill him. It makes him stronger. No way. Yes. Yo, ban everybody out of the street. Look this at who! Disgusting. Look at who! He's only being biased. What well, accused chest of being biased? Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Okay, chat. Go ahead. Go ahead and explain to me. Why why Godzilla's cooler than King Kong? Because number one, he can actually take a nuke. And not only that, he breathes atomic fire, not lasers, atomic fire. He can drill in the middle of the earth, or drill a big hole into the middle of the earth. Um, let me see, what else makes him cool? Bro, just him alone is just cool. His design is cool. His roar is cool. Um, basically, every version of Godzilla, his roar is cool. And, and majority of versions of Godzilla's can't.
die to bullets. Like the majority of versions of King Kong can. That's why I like Monster vs. Kong. He ain't weak. He ain't dying to no bullets. But he ain't, but he ain't dying to no missiles either. The majority of King Kong versions of King Kong will get killed by a missile. Meanwhile, majority of the time, a missile will barely tickle Godzilla. Let's be for real. And I think both of them are kind of lame. I'm not going to sit and act like King Kong's the coolest thing ever, because he's not. I feel like he's lying about that. I feel like he's trying to cover it up. His roar. You know what? Yes, yes. His roar is what makes it cool, because he don't even know what his roar sound like. Let's. I'm going to just show y'all. Let me, let me hold on. Because we all know what legendary versions sound like. I'm not even gonna pull up no Haystale or Shower version. Alright, hold up. Um, Hear this in the theaters in 2014 when this movie came out, you will understand. Let me try to find another one. As a matter of fact, let me let's do the airport scene. Oh, that's a custom one. The airport scene. Y'all, you talk about King Kong having aura. This is pure aura right here. Don't want a desk-bound 9-to-5 job? Right. Universal Technical Where Institute's Automotive Technology Program can teach you how to diagnose... I need to buy YouTube Premium. That's, that's my fault. I gotta buy YouTube Premium. I will act this You see? You see? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me play that again. Why is this video not possible? Why is this video not possible? Right, let me play that again. As you can see, all the humans are screaming. But as soon as Godzilla put his foot down, that's when they that's when they all stop screaming. If that don't scream all right there, I don't know what does. Cause I feel like everybody uses the term R to you loosely, so why not for this one? Look. You see how they all stop screaming? Now let's do the roar, let's do the roar. I love this roar so much. Imagine hearing that in theaters for the first time in 2014. I remember hearing that roar for the first time in 2014. Oh, it made my heart sink low key. Hold up. I'm probably about to edit some of these things out. I'm not going to lie. So let, oh yeah, let's get back to the video. Let's get back to the video. Over here, tell us uh, Let's get back to the video. Buddy, what? He's a fire-breathing lizard. He doesn't breathe ordinary fire. He's not like a flamethrower. Yo, 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 you think, you think exactly. about the TriStar verse. He, here's the best way I think... I this man literally thinking about the TriStar version of Godzilla, 1998. This Godzilla is built different, bro. I can describe it. The things that make him cool make him lame. How? If that makes any sense. No! It don't! Does that make any sense? No. Okay, okay, let's let's picture this. Little kids got a piece of paper and a pen 
He's thinking of the most absurd monster he can think of. It's a giant dragon that shoots lightning bolts out of his hands, breathes fire, and can, like, like you know, do all this crazy stuff. Chad, is that not lame to you? How is that lame? How is that lame? If the person who's making that movie or whatever it is, if he manages to do it correctly, it will be so cool. Have a dragon not only breathe fire out of his mouth, but light, shoot lightning out of his hands? Bro, that would literally be awesome. And see a giant dragon fight another giant dragon or another giant kaiju at that? Bro. I'm starting to think, bro. Okay, so now we're just trolling. No! Yo, Caliber with the 25 like, gifted subs, chat. Give giddy. me some W's for Caliber with the 25 gifted. Appreciate you, Caliber. You're just a hater? Yeah. Um, I'm really yes, not. Yes, you are. You chat, are. I'm really not. It's just, it's not cool. I mean, you can say it's not cool, but to say he's lame, come on. It's just not cool. It's a giant lizard that shoots fire and lasers. It's like, whoa. Whoa. God he doesn't destroy just do the building. Whoa. He doesn't just destroy cities. He fights other whoa, kaiju. Man, Godzilla stepped on something and it broke. Whoa. You know what? You know what one core member? You know what? And that's how I know he's ignorant. Because he literally he barely knows anything about Godzilla. So I can see if you actually done your research on Godzilla and say he's not really cool, but you, right now you're just being ignorant. You you clearly don't know nothing about Godzilla. You clearly don't know nothing about him. Memory that has stuck with me throughout the Godzilla and, and King Kong um, whole thing was Godzilla or no was King Kong King Kong. Climbing that skyscraper, grabbing helicopters out of the sky, and throwing them. That's what Let's stuck see. in my memory. That right there is Aura. Be forward. Be fucking forward. Yo, Caliber with the 10,000 bits chat. Give me some W's for Caliber with the 10,000 bits. Appreciate you, Caliber. Captain with the five as well. Appreciate you. But yeah, Chad, if you don't like that, I'm sorry. That's just my take on the whole situation. He's just being biased. Um. Because at the end of the day, I'm just reacting to the video. I, you can be upset all you want, but at the end of the day, it, it is a, his opinion. But can you, you can't take his opinion seriously. He says Spider-Man is lame. Spider-Man. The greatest fictional character of all time is lame. So you know, I, I he, you can't really take him that serious. But I'm right now. I'm just the reactor. I feel like he's just being biased a little. He's being ignorant a little. I just want to give my. I just want to get my. Uh, put my little two cents in. With his. With this. Godzilla too. literally levels cities. He has so much aura. Here we go again. So so so. So King Kong so grabbing a helicopter is aura, but Godzilla not not I mean lovingly a city that's not aura. So that clip I showed you when Godzilla put his foot down caused everybody to stop screaming. That's not aura. Be for real. Be for real. This is literally bias. Talk about what Godzilla does. Yes. The fact that he can level a city makes him lame. How? Because it's so out there and unrealistic and stupid. I can't even think for two seconds. But, hold on, listen to this. Cool. Listen to this. I mean, come on, man. Yo, local with the five, Austin. With the 10 gift, appreciate you. Shout I'm sorry, to him. I had to get that off my chest. But yeah, still so Kong got Orton so much aura. Jason Forchies. Oh, oh, oh. 
So Jason Voorhees got all this aura. He ain't nothing. <coughs> Why am I coughing so much? He he ain't nothing but a zombie that got bullied that when he was a, ch a child before he turned into a zombie. All he do is stab people. Now, I'm not gonna sit up here and try discredit Jason saying he's not cool. But to call Jason cool and Godzilla's lame is honestly is insane to me. Big dude with a mask with a machete hunting people down. See, something like that's cool because it's like, okay, I can like, you know, you know what I mean? No. Well, I kind of do, but still. Bro, that's lame. You think Jason is lame compared to Godzilla? If, you, if we use your logic, then he is. If your logic. See, I don't know what's gotten into y'all recently, Chad, but some of y'all's takes here recently have, like, like border Bro, on. Bro, nobody takes is worse than yours. I still barely can get over the fact that you call Spider-Man lame. Peter Parker. Now, even though that's his whole thing, he is supposed to be a whole doofus, a dweeb. But this man, he, he is, he's not no ordinary human being. He has got super strength. He is able to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Hulk. I heard in one comment he did knock out the hawk or maybe put down the hawk for a little bit. But the fact, and not only that, he's probably the most relatable character in fiction. Despite him having powers, he's low-key the most relatable one. He's broke like a, like a lot of us. He, you know, he goes through a lot of stuff that these kids go through. And it's like he's the most relatable person. This I, I'm about to do a super video on that, but to call Spider-Man lame... Are we serious? I am criminal. Borderline criminal. You Mr. call Godzilla's borderline criminal. Yo, Owen gifted a hundred solves. Oh, give me some it. W's for Owen with the hundred gifting. W's, W's. Yo! Yo, Chad, give me some W's for Owen with the with the one. With the 100 that's, gifted that's subs, machine. yo, Owen, I appreciate I that forgot. so much love, Owen, thank you. I forgot that Yo, stayed with machine. the five as well, appreciate you. W, Owen, man. Chat, y'all are saying, ooh, y'all know it's a fart machine, look. Y'all really think I'm on, y'all really Sound think one. Leatherface is good? Yo, somebody just said, said a name just a second ago, I forgot he also, Arthur Morgan, for example, is cooler than, than Godzilla. Oh, wait, who's off the morgue? I forgot who he is. Arthur Morgan. I'm about to edit that now. I have to edit that now. Solid Snake is cooler than Godzilla. Solid Snake? I'm surprised he even like a character named Solid. Who's that? I never heard of that. But I, but I heard of him. Red Dead Redemption. I forgot about him. For Fortnite? Or, oh. He's not from Fortnite. He's from Metal Gear. Is Solid Snake a cute acoustic? Oh Lord! Oh, oh wow! Mm. Link is cooler than Godzilla. No, oh, he's not. Be for um, real. Who else? Why, just Jack say. from Jack and Daxter is cooler than Godzilla. Ratchet from Ratchet and Clank is how? No, he's not cooler than Godzilla. No, he's not. Kratos is cooler than Godzilla. That's the beta. You want to know why? Because why? because these are all like realistic. Look, but aside, like you know, obviously, but like there's nothing realistic about any of these. 
Not even remotely close to realistic. Not a giant dinosaur lizard creature that that just destroys cities. He does just destroy cities. Ooh, here's a question, chat. Listen to this. Now listen say to this a one. city has to be destroyed, right? Follow me on this. Say a city has to be destroyed. How would you rather watch it be destroyed? Godzilla stepping on it and destroying it? Or Kratos and Thor fighting and just breaking buildings as they fight through it? That's not the same. If you're going to have Kratos and Thor fighting, you might as well have, you got to have Godzilla and fight another kaiju. That's the only way it'll be comparable. Of course, Godzilla destroying the city by himself is not going to be all that hype or whatnot. But seeing Kratos and Thor fight, that's going to be real cool. That's going to be epic to see. Just like watching Godzilla vs. King Ghidorah or Godzilla watching King Kong fight. You got it. You can't compare the two because it's not little, It's not nearly the same. It's Godzilla just destroying buildings by herself. Which is a cooler way for it to be destroyed? And if you're in here talking about Godzilla, you are you are unironically trolling. It's not the same. It's not comparable. You gotta have Godzilla fight another kaiju. Dude, y'all are y'all are trolling. Let, let's let's like your bias. You know what? What is the coolest King Kong clip? You know what? Yeah, let's do a comparison. You Chat, know what? what is the coolest King Kong clip? Yo, lady with the five, appreciate you. Now let's watch. You found the right model. For sure. Now, how can you be sure you're... I don't know if I can watch this. Well, I'll get like... Yo, W. Owen, for real. Appreciate you, Owen. You could get copyrighted, so to edit it out. So how many times am I gonna we get can't this ad? save you from being tagged in a failed video. Did I just watch this but ad? But we can save you big bucks. Like Bro's gonna get copyrighted, yo. Legitimately, I am. Yeah. What is that? That right there alone is cooler than anything I've ever seen Godzilla do in my whole life. You see, bias, bias. Bro came flying in with a giant boulder and hit him over the head what? with it. You know what? I feel like he's low key a King Kong fan. Yo, I'm missing bits. Hold up. You know what? Let me show you something cool. Yo, Krampus with the 5,000. Because he said that thermonuclear guys was not cool early in the video, later in the video. So let's, let's see this. Where's the audio? There's no audio. Hey man, there's no audio, but let's watch. This this had no audio by the way. Look at that. Look at that, bro. Literally look at that. So you tell me what's cooler. King Kong swiping at a helicopter, like you say, it has so much aura or guys in the suplex and Kong. If you say that King Kong swept in a helicopter is more aura than Godzilla doing that. You're just biased. You're literally just biased. You are a certified King Kong fan. Krampus with the 5,000 bits. <laughs> Wait, did he get carried? Mm. Mm. I guess you could say that. Straight what up. What is this? Yo, Rush with the 5 gift appreciate you. Now, chat. 
What is the coolest thing that you've ever seen uh, 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 Godzilla do? Super King Kong. Nothing, nothing that cool. And chat is being biased right, right now. Exactly. He Multiple said, people just said. Oh, because hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me see this part. Oh my bad. He thought that was King Kong. That thing's cooler than Godzilla. How? He literally said he don't even know what that thing is. And he's talking about something. It's cooler than Godzilla. That is straight biasness. He just what, who is that? Godzilla. That thing's cooler than Godzilla. He's literally being Yo, biased. Oh, with 50, get the, get he's the, saying that he don't hate Godzilla, but he clearly do. He's literally a King Kong glazer. That's what it looks like. Cause ain't no way you gonna try to say that King Kong is lame. They're gonna backtrack later. Tell about so, ooh, King Kong's making a skull call which has so much aura. They gonna come go come over here and say thermonuclear guys was not cool then. See something like this. And say this is cooler than Godzilla. She can't do nothing. All she can do is just walk around and shoot webs out her mouth. Compared to this, which one is cooler? Shoot webs out your mouth or shoot an atomic fire that's powerful enough to drill a hole into the center of the earth within one minute or five to one minute? I don't know how long it took. And not only that, being able to take a nuclear bomb to the face. W's for Owen with the 50 gifted. Bro, chat was legit flaming it's, this man. It's Scylla? Yeah. Appreciate you for the 50 yo chat. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm fan. And do Loki something you say. Get that on the day. W Owen, man. Yeah, he, he clearly don't. Oh, let me guess. Godzilla kills all. Oh. To stop Godzilla from getting bigger. <laughs> yes. Yes. This man because he's the king. Little. No, he's not. Yes, he, he is. Yes, he is. He's literally called. Godzilla the king of the monster. The people that make Godzilla call him the king of the monster. That's literally his title. His name is Godzilla, but his title is king of the monsters. I go to King Kong is the king. It's in his name. Yo, Chad, give me some Scout W's for Owen again, though, with the 250 bro. gifted subs on the day, bro. W Owen, dude. Yo, Owen, I appreciate you. Yo, Kelt, Kelt with the five as well. Appreciate you, Kelt. So, Chad, did this change anybody's mind? These couple out of context clips? Chad should make a the clip of Godzilla Suplex and King Kong. Did you know you can AFK Bloods and Zaya whilst learning to code in Python? Go to boot.dev. Dude, Godzilla's just cooler, chat. What are you saying? Dude, Godzilla's just cooler, chat. Is he trolling? And I think, like, the creators of the show go out of their way to, like, try to make Godzilla look cooler than he actually is. Godzilla's always that nigga, bro. You're just ignorant. But anyway, that's the end of this video. At the end of the day, this is Queso opinion. You could be mad all, all you want, but at the end of the day, it is a piss opinion. Even though he was clearly biased. He was clearly biased. But there's nothing we could do about it. So, at the end of the day, I'll just do a reaction to this video. I'm out, man.